Alright, what's a Pokemon fan? That time three here, back with more Shining Pearl. Decided to get past the intro this time because it takes a while for it to uh, actually load through. So during the last episode, we ended up uh, going, defeating Tyler, going through um, the last route and ending at Orberg Gate. If I remember how the original game was, there's two-way trainers here, and then we get to Orberg City. We try and close up challenges anywhere. That's what we do. It's what we do. We jump to Camper Curtis. Camper Curtis set up Shake. Go Totter. Shake the Timonate, then knocked out my attack stat. Well, Fury Card does more damage, more time to hits in a row, so it shouldn't be too much of an issue. Especially when just one shot takes out over half his health. Tyre's defense fell. And Fury Cutter. That's it. Need some experience points. We defeated Camper Curtis. Hmm, <laughs> it's sufficiently raised. 392 for winning. Celebrate my game to escape, I'm going to battle you. You're telling the Picnicker Diana. You're the Diana set out Badu. If it's just regular but, uh, grass, I think I can one shot it. No, but it's bug it must be grass and poison, which means it's still knocked it out, but it's not super effective. Gain experience points. Psyduck. That's fine. Should have a problem with that one. Cloud 9, fact that the weather disappeared. The Fury Cutter. Fully Psyduck fainted. Forget that, just some late early game might be used to overpower with just Fury Cutter alone. You just be a ticket here Deanna. Well, I guess it's something to. Losing is something to commemorate too. You got 380 for, 380 for winning. Here we go, we're in Orbert now. Howdy, trainer. If you know a single gym edge, other trainers will look down on you like you're a total noob, right? So I'll show you where the town's Pokemon gym is. Huh? There's someone there. Some tells me I should heal before I go talk to him. If I remember right, he tried to tell me to a battle, but I could be remembering wrong. Where's the Where's the Pokemon Center? There it is. No, I didn't want to do it again. Switch on the PCN Pokemon Center connected to the Pokemon boxes. So you need to store or bring up with your Pokemon. Maybe it'll access the Pokemon boxes from the menu screen. Go to change your appearance for the Union Room. Head the reception to the left on the second floor. Yay. Trade a Pokemon at the Gold Club, Club downstairs. She's still not going to let me through. Nope. Ahead, there's a huge mountain that towers above everything. Divide Sinnoh into two distinct halves. There are a lot of different TMs. It's tricky to say what, which Pokemon should learn what moves. I remember my brain shoes on. It feels like I'm in the center of attention. Too many one off to work in the mine. Huh? How was you, Ryan? You finally got here. Your soul, like always. So slow, the lone gym leader's long gone now. Said he had to go to, uh, oh yeah, Arbor Mine. My bed's right, so it's no big deal to me, but. Why are you standing there like an idiot? If I'm so slow, then why are you just standing there wasting time? That make a lot of sense. You know how Pokemon have different natures like we have personalities. I don't think it's surprising to see Pokemon in different colors. You ever seen or heard about shiny Pokemon? They have different colors than usual. First is the Pikachu's yellow crack. Well, shiny Pikachu is a sort of orange. Vents exchange a lot of air, hot air below with the fresh air from outside. Looking down, I'm good to an urge to start yep, yelling into him, hello. <laughs> Check out some of the other houses and stuff around here real quick. 
Rorik's list has turned Pokemon into mine. There are eight gym leaders in the center region. The judges will find trainers to get gym badges from them all. Gym leader isn't like any other trainer you meet. T I'd take as many as possible if I were with you. If I were you. Get your Pokemon here. Take this as you'd like. You obtain a Dust Ball. Dust Ball is Pokemon designed for use in the darkness. Works better if you use it at night or in a cave. Gymnasium Pokemon is the way to go. It makes you feel as though you're acting as if they're your own. I mean, they're of yellow just because of its color. I don't understand the logic behind that at all. <laughs> maybe for, maybe he constantly forget what color yellow is, therefore he just calls his Pokemon yellow. Have you seen the vents? They release steam from down below. Let's listen to you have a Pokemon called Machop, which would trade one for my Abra. I think you can get I think you can get one in order of mine. A Pokemon obtained a trait grows quickly. If Pokemon grows too too much, it will often ignore the trainer. Of course, it won't matter if you have a lot of gym badges. Um, I wonder where you can get a Machop. Because that Abra sounds like a good Pokemon to have. Um, Pokemon special power called an ability. That was useful. My Pokemon, how my Pokemon and I are alike. It's not anything I explain easily. The view is good from up here, but the pain going out. You don't mind how it show me a Pokemon called Zubat. Don't have one yet. Rourke is a town's gym leader. He may be young, but he keeps his mind running safely and efficiently. Rourke is a user of rock-type Pokemon. Do you think rock-type Pokemon are nice? I like how lumpy they are. Arbor Mine. Mining Museum, I mean. Well, this Pokemon must, the Pokemon that carry this thing must be terribly strong. Well, this is cool. I never expected something that big. How about that? Orbit Mine ascends under the sea floor. Hello, welcome to the Orbit Mining Museum. Hello, hello, how are you? I studied Pokemon fossils. Me, right here and now. On the verge of breakthrough, I am to achieve the extraction of from fossils. From fossils, I extract Pokemon, but not yet, n not yet, not yet. So you can come back here and you can revive fossils, uh, Pokemon from fossils. I think I've explored just about everywhere. Oh, there's this one house right here. You remind me so much of the time I got my first Pokemon. I always have rotten time trying to decide what moves my Pokemon should learn. I think Pokemon can use some toughening up. Why not training in the order of mine? Yeah, I'm gonna see. I think you can get Machop there. If that's the case, I might train for the Abra. Large Pokemon's eyes are slightly swinging and brightly. See, it makes me happy. Here, I want you to have this. You obtain a Great Ball. You know how Pokemon how Pokemon stage set their Pokeballs? I tried to think about it. What would be best? What what would be the best Pokeballs for them? So, um, like I explained earlier, the Dust Ball works a good night or in caves. Um, the Great Ball is basically the better version of the Pokeball. It just works better than regular Pokeball does. Orbit Mine is separated with the utmost, operate with the utmost care. You avoid causing any damage to the natural habitats of Pokemon. The whole system of taking the coal out of the mine is automated. There's nothing backbreaking about it. Well, except probably the people who are busting into the mine and probably putting it on the carts, but yeah. Okay, my Pokemon are fully healed. Let's head down to the mine then. I'm pretty sure that's the only other thing we can do. I think we can go to this route, but I don't think there's anything here we can do. Slopes are slippery, you need a bike to get up. If you don't have a bike, there's a cycling shop in a turn of city. I think there's one item over here, though. At least I thought there was. Hidden ones? Maybe not. You obtain a Pokeball. There's berries up there, but I can't get up there yet. Geodude. Is there a hidden item up here? Yep, another Pokeball. Not that I need them at this point. What else? Another Geodude. Hmm. 
Run from this one as well. Do I match up my Pokedex here? I don't think I do. No, I don't. Just a thought, maybe I ran the one before, but I guess I didn't. No, oh, over mine's down this way, not up not down over there. Dun 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 dun. Everyone's proud of the vine. Everyone's digging for coal under the sea as we speak. It's amazing how they do it. Chop, chop, my chop, chop, chop away on the rocks. Taking a core of a coal mine. Wonderful. That's excellent of you. It's always good to learn about new things and broaden your horizons. I like how they make the conveyor belts move too. You can't just see the coal moving on the conveyor belts. I think that's kind of cool. It's probably doesn't like the game at all, actually. Usually movements like that, like on the overworld, will do stuff like that, but I guess not in this instance. Um, can I get over to see that guy? Maybe. Hard to say. Can I get through here? I can. There's no question that this is hard, hard work, but being working with my Pokemon gives me a boost somehow. Here, take one of these. You obtain a Super Potion. Like a regular potion, a Super Potion gives you Pokemon health back, but it stores 30 more HP up to a fit, which means 50. Feel, feeling hale and hard puts a smile on my face. It makes me happy. Alright, let's go in and around here. The pile of dirty sand is called slag heap. It's the, it's the waste from it's the waste from sorting coal. No, actually, I didn't know that. Found a bag of stardust. Cool. That sells for some cash, I think. Alright. I didn't even know that about coal. Did you guys know that? Because I didn't. Okay. We're in Orbit Mine. Everyone knows the coal... Works, where's the coal mine keeps their own Pokemon with them. They may be challenged to battles. For one that looks just like rocks. They sure surprised me. Anything around here? Oh, there's an item here. You found an X defense. The next one can be used in battle to raise your defense stat by one point. And only lasts through the, through the battle that's in. Okay, what do we got? Geo dude. Probably should put uh uh how can I never remember Piplop's nickname? Pippy? Yeah. Or Pilly, damn it. Uh, I'm gonna put Pilly up front because it looks like a lot of Pokemon here are rock types and Pilly's really good with that, with the rock type, so. I made this rock on t uh, Route 207. Now they're my most, become my most treasured partners. That is actually useful information. Let me get my town map out. I thought I had a town map. Oh, that's right. It's, I think you have to, uh, yeah, press start. Route 207. Oh, cool, so that is right outside, um... They can be found right outside there, apparently. Let's go back and see if I can find one, then. I mean, that was Route 207, right? I wasn't just imagining things. I'm gonna see if I can find a Machop then trade for the Abra. Machop in itself is a good Pokemon, but... A bit dated. I think I like Abra better, anyway. That's Route 207, right? Is that what it said? Yeah. So that means I should be able to find a Machop here. Probably start waiting for all the Geodudes around here. I'll look for a couple minutes and then I'll give up if I can't even find one. Another Geodude. Probably a good place to uh, hunt shiny Geodude, but other than that... There's one. That took a lot less time than I thought it would. We're going for a basic pound, because I got a feeling Largon will knock it out in one shot. 
Low kick. Pound. One more should do it, and then I can catch it. There we go. Focus energy. So basically what it just did just then, it raised its critical hit uh, ratio. Which means you can land critical hits more easily now, but I don't think this could be an issue because I'm going to catch him right here. Got it. Gotcha. My chop was caught. How am I getting experience points? My chop's data will be added to the Pokédex. Machop, super power Pokemon. Type fighting, height 27, weight 43 pounds. And muscles never cramp, no matter how, however much it trains. It lives in the mountains, away from humans. I'm not even going to bother, because he's probably going directly for the Abra anyway. So. Let's have a look at that Machop, though, real quick. Adamant Nature. Ooh, that's actually really good. No guard, too. Adamant nature, that's pretty good nature, too. Well, hopefully the average doesn't come out in adamant, but it might. Where was that place at? Is it here? I, I forgot where you can... It was a little girl, wasn't it? No. Not this one. This one? I know it was on the first floor, whoever was going to trade it. There it is. Okay, I like that trading animation. So we're sent over Kaza. Take care, care of Kaza. Every day we add to the Pokédex. Just me or is he like floating side, like slightly sideways? Anyway, number 20, Abra, Psy Pokémon. Type Psychic, height 211, weight 43 pounds. Even while it's asleep, it maintains a telepathic radar. It teleports when it's threatened. Okay, let's have a look at Abra. So Abra's level 9, has an orange berry. Quiet. Ooh, that's not bad. It lowers its speed, but special attack increases. Oh, it knows it's teleport, though. That's not great. Um, I guess I'll have to train him. I don't even know when he learns the next, uh, his next move. Oh, that's right. I don't, I don't really have to battle with him because, well, I think if he's in battle, I think he gets more experience. But we don't need the, him to put up front then, I don't think. So let's put Piplup back up, or Pilly back on top. Dang it. Put him in the back. Now we're going to head back to Orberg Mine. I wanted to get Abra before I started training because of, uh, because, or, I got here because there's trainers here that'll, that'll battle us, so, I want to make sure Abra can get the experience it needs. Geodude. We're also going to be fighting wild Pokemon. I think Abra might want a new move at level 10 or 11, I'm not really sure. Quick plot activates what I go first, even though I was faster in the first place. Pretty much, I'm pretty sure I was. No sturdy abilities, that's an, an automatic knockout. I'm gonna let you in a secret. I sent my Pokemon to work. Didn't the guy outside just say you can take your own Pokemon in here? Why would you need to take him to work if you could just take him in? You're trying to work for Mason. Machop. Water Gun will do a significant amount of damage, I think. Yep. Goes for Low Kick. Low Kick is determined by the um, Pokemon's weight. How heavy they are. The heavier the Pokemon is, the more damage it actually does. So, well, Pilly's not that heavy, so it didn't do too much damage to, to her. 
Okay, Pilgrim to level 12. HP and attack by 2. Defense, special attack, special defense, and speed by 1. Pedigree to level 12. HP by 3. Attack by 2. Defense, special attack, special defense, and speed by 1. You see a worker mason. Well, now aren't you something? You got 648 for winning. I get that? Thank you. You obtained found a potion. Fine, already then. Just a quick battle on my break. By the way, the guy I just passed, not this guy, but the other guy was Rourke. Rourke of Colin. I just wanted to get all the stuff down before I talk to him. I'm pretty sure I don't have to fight him here, but, you know. Water gun. Click while well, activate. Due to fate. Put my any experience points. Kaza grew to level 10. HP and attack by 1, defense by 0, special attack by 3, special defense by 1, speed by 3. By the Senate Onyx, that's fine. Water Gun should knock it out. Yep. That's right, Kazakh gets extra experience points because it's a trade Pokemon, too, so that lets him blow a little bit faster. <laughs> mercy. I cry mercy. 160 for winning. What's this? You found an escape rope. I can use that to get out of here if I wanted to. Nothing up there, so let's go talk to Rourke then. Nope. Now I'm trying to talk to Rourke. Okay, stand back and watch this. Do the hidden move rock smash get rid of the boulder blocking your way? Hobos and your smashes are out of the way. To get the best from the gym in town, you'd be able to do this too. Of course, you'd have to be the gym leader first. That'd be me. I think characters in this game can walk faster than I can run. Onyx. Fine. So bind in this game just causes small amount of damage over time if the battle goes on too long. Sturdy and Onyx endured the hit. Got her a little bit by the mind. Sturdy lets you survive with 1 HP if you're taken from full HP to 0 HP. So 1 pound should be enough to knock it out. No matter how strong it is. Pilgrim to level 13. HP by 3, attack and defense by 1. Special attack by 2, special defense and speed by 1. Kazakh to level 11. HP by 2, attack by 0. Defense by 1, special attack by 2, special defense by 1, and speed by 2. Let's go back to the full with Henry Heal, then we'll head to the gym. Heal up. Okay. So, let's head to the gym now. Howdy, how's it going, champ to be? That's why I said a really important boy earlier, too. Gym winners is a loser rock type Pokemon. Well, listen, rock type Pokemon really hate water, all right? They're also weak to grass moves. Gee, they sure have weaknesses. Don't think it'll be easy. You don't get to be the gym leader without covering for weaknesses. Go well, after a rock type one with a fire type won't be easy either. That's all the advice I can give. Thanks for listening. You avoid the long way around. Let's see why you do that. So I can get stronger? You're joined by youngster Jonathan. 
computer. Only Tata I taught Tata Rock Smash, so I should be able to do super effective damage. Might not be a stab move, but it's super effective. I like the animation for that, actually. Although, to be honest with you, I probably should have killed Geodude if it's called Rock Smash, because Geodude literally is a rock. Level 10 Pokemon 2 Rourke might be a bit of a challenge. Defense Curl. Not gonna help him much. Geodude's gone. Defeat Jumpster Jonathan. Now I understand why you decided to battle with me. 440 for winning. Those who want to win can challenge a Pokemon gym. Only those who want to win can challenge a Pokemon gym. You are challenged by youngster Darius. Geodude. A couple of rock smashers have knocked this one out. Dude, who fainted. Tatter go to level 13. HP by 3, attack by 2, defense by 1, special attack, special attack, and speed by 2. Onyx. I'll keep in. Keeping him in is a bit of a risk, but I think I'm, I'll be fine. Only because Rock is strong against uh, Bug, so... Duty goes for. Critical hit, nice. Tackle. No Rock move then, that's good. Onyx fainted. What am I getting experience points? Defeat Youngster Darius. <sighs> this is humiliating. You got 416 for winning. So, um, I'm actually going to fight Rourke right now. I'm going to uh, use a potion that I know I have enough of. To heal the damage that Potter has taken. Um, Pilly is probably going to steal this match for me. But let's just see what happens. So we're going to save just in case I get my butt kicked. Because it seems like I've already lost once. I really don't want to have to do that again if I don't have to. Welcome. This is the Orber Pokemon Gym. I'm Rock, the gym leader. I'm but one trainer to decide to walk proudly with Rock-type Pokemon. So, gym leader, I need to see your potential as a trainer. I need to see the toughness of the Pokemon that battle with you. You're challenged by gym leader Rourke. Geodude. Water gun. Put on a higher level, I think. Maybe at least one of them are. One shot Geodude. Hazard grew to level 12. HE by 2, attack by 1, defense by 0, special attack by 3, special defense by 1, and speed by 2. Onyx. I think the original game he only had two Pokemon, but I guess in this one they had to tough it up a little bit. Rock throw. Quite a bit of damage. Critical hit, too. 30. Yep. Work use the potion. Okay, so that's gonna heal Donix for probably most of his HP. Yep. Town's not gonna do too much then. Water gun. Clip all activates, that's good. That's the end of Onyx. Onyx fainted. Pillar go to level uh, 14. HP by 2, attack by 2, defense, special attack, special defensive speed by 1. Cranidos. 
don't know if Kratos has any rock type moves, but I don't remember it learning moves very often. So you could take the next one if you did the other ones. Send out Kratos. Kratos breaks the mold. Rock smash. I'm faster, that's something. Nice. Bulldoze. That ground type move um, lowers my speed when it hits, but it's not very effective. No way, not yet. Not giving up. All I need to do is land more, one more rock smash. Goes for a headbutt this time. That's it. Alright, we beat Rourke. Actually, easier time than I thought. Tower go to level 14. HP and attack by 2. Defense and special attack and special defense by 1. And speed by 2. Kaiser go to level... Oh, Tower wants to move with Zorb. Let's get rid of Pound, then. I'm only going to give him Zorb because uh, a re restores HP. to be useful against Rock-type Pokemon. Tower forgot Pound, and Zorb Zorb instead. Kaiser go to level 13. HP by 2. Attack by 0. Defense by 1. Special attack by 2. Special defense and speed by 1. You defeat Jim Leader Rourke. What? That can't be. I buffed up Pokemon. 1,960 for winning. This is embarrassing. But the trainer didn't have a single gym badge. That's the story. You were strong and I was weak. That's all there is. According to the Pokemon League rules, I have to give you our gym badge since you beat me. The gym leader. Here's your official Pokemon League Cole badge. Receive the Cole badge from Rourke. I mean, the cool badge means now you can use the hidden move Rock Smash from your Poketch. You should also take these two. You've seen the TM 976s. TM 76 can hidden move Stealth Rock. Smooth and inflicts damage on opponents that switch into battle. The stickers I use. Here, take some. You take the stickers that Rourke uses. That way, a team will teach the move to his Pokemon instantly. The team will still break when you use it, so you won't want to be certain that a Pokemon will learn that move. Alright. We got pretty far. I have to thank everyone for watching. This is the Pokemon Fan 1993 signing off. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care. Bye bye.